One of the concerns about using those type of materials for scab was we want, what's the word, we want, um, not re-wetting, we want redistribution. And those early sprays, well, we kind of want redistribution, you know, we, we, because we've just got, you know, a little leaf coming out or small fruit. Growth. They wanted to run down on new growth. Our experience has been when we've looked at new film in scab programs full season, I think we ultimately get better scab control. You're going to be spraying every seven to ten days. You're going to get some material that is moving. What we're trying to do is keep more deposits from the time you spray and hit something. We want to retain more deposits there every single time you spray over a greater surface area. The problem with the surfactant or something that's more of a yep. surfactant, initially if you go behind the sprayer, you say, oh, I'm getting very good coverage. But then if you came back 24 hours or 48 hours later, or certainly even if you got a quarter of an inch of rain, you'll see more of your deposits are sitting down here. Oh, you do. Because that yep. surfactant, yeah, exactly. that surfactant is re-wetting right. and spreading. New film, we want a lot of little BBs over, over a greater surface. It's like having a bullseye. We want lots of little spots, little target spots. But we want you to come back 48 hours later, four days later, even after rainfall, and we want to have more of those deposits over more surface area. To protect from, be it scab, or if you've got worm pressure. You know, if the worm's crawling around here, and your deposits are all down here. You go right in. <laughs> what, you know, if you have new film in a program, that new film <laughs> is something that he's Beautiful. got. Spores were only viable outside host tissue for a certain period of time. The, hard, the longer it takes for that spore to penetrate into that surface, the more difficult it is for that scab spore to set. Johnny Albert of West Virginia said, hey, I've shown that new film by itself is reducing scab infection because it's putting a film as a barrier. It's built, well, it's actually, it's building up another cuticle layer.